Two students secretly mixed different chemicals and placed them into an alcohol burner. Suddenly, flames erupted violently, and the two students directly poured the fuel into the pool. Fortunately, they emerged completely unscathed. However, this also proved that their rocket fuel had been successfully developed. They arrived at the mining area to conduct a launch experiment. Unexpectedly, the rocket veered off course during flight and nearly hit a passerby. Luckily, that person did not blame them. Instead, he pointed out the issue with the rocket. He said that ordinary steel cannot withstand sustained high temperatures. Heat-resistant steel is required. However, this type of steel is extremely rare and expensive. Homer and his three companions simply couldn't afford it. So, they adopted another approach. They went to a 12-mile-long abandoned railway track and began to dismantling the tracks piece by piece. Just as they were getting excited about their money-making prospects, the sound of a train whistle echoed in the distance. Fortunately, it was a false alarm. With the money earned from dismantling the tracks, they purchased a high-temperature steel rod. With the man's help, they completed the subsequent processing of the steel rod and continued with their experiments. However, each experiment either ended in an immediate explosion or failed to take off. While dismantling 30 lay tracks, the top students suspected that the propellant might be impure. After launch, the high temperature inside the rocket would cause it to expand and explode. Therefore, they upgraded the booster fuel to 100% pure alcohol. When the excited team arrived at the mining area ready to launch, they found the site crowded with spectators. It turned out they were colleagues invited by his brother to witness the spectacle. Homer wasn't angry. He withstood the pressure and activated the ignition device. The rocket soared into the sky. The audience who had come to watch cheered for their success. Even the teacher praised them. 